One chef who I know will go nuts for these guys is Scotty Bridger. He's got an awesome reputation for healthy cooking using fresher than fresh produce. The only thing fresher in this kitchen than these wonderful mangy walnuts is my fresh faced mate, Scotty Bridger. Mate, how good are these? They're so good. Oh, can't there's, believe how creamy they are. There's nothing better than uh, local fresh nuts. Flavours, the aromas, the, uh, the natural oils are still there. They look bloody delicious and taste great. What are you making? What I'm going to make today is a, a, like a play on a carrot and walnut cake for cool. dessert. Got your little bowls of that looks pretty good. What's in there? We've got a carrot marmalade here and some brandy snaps, uh, some walnut sponge, um, some little borage leaves. Oh. Today, mate, I'm going to get you to help me. Egg whites straight in, huh? Egg whites straight in. Okay. A little bit of salt. We're going to whip the uh, yolks up with yep. some more sugar. Then we're going to fold our hazelnut meal through there. Right. So there's actually no flour in this dish. It's just the walnuts in there that's, that's the base of it. So you've just blitzed that up and yep. you're going to use that. So that's gluten-free? Yep, gluten-free sponge. He's clever, isn't he? So next stage, Scotty, we'll get this meringue yep. out. Straight in here, Scotty. Straight in there, mate. Oh, look at that. Nice and stiff. Come on. I like it. Oh. <laughs> Scotty, uh, what happens with mixing bowls at home? You've got a couple of young boys. Yeah, well, they're usually fight, fighting over to lick the paddle. On Christmas Day, do you find yourself stuck in the kitchen or does someone else do the cooking? Oh, uh, look, I'd, I think cooking for family is so different than cooking in a restaurant, yeah. you know? Like, it's when your family's around, everyone's in there and uh, you got some uh, nice Christmas tunes on and a glass of wine in your hand. There's what? nothing better, your family around. We've got our creamed egg yolks, yep. a little bit of sugar, some corn flour and a touch of baking powder. Then add our walnut meal to that. OK. And then we're just going to very, very lightly fold the meringue through that. Right and that's our sponge, it's that easy. And the Logie for best folding. <laughs> and, mate, boys at six and four, they get so excited. There's nothing oh. like getting out of bed in the morning, having this fantastic cooking experience, family and cooking and food for me yeah. at Christmas Day. That's yeah. what it's all about, right? I think having young kids, you see it through their eyes. Yeah. Like good food as presents and, you know, yeah. we're all big kids in, 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 at heart, aren't we? Yeah. Especially you. Some of us more than others. <laughs> right, eh, mate? I reckon we're good. Perfect. Pop it into the oven for about 20 minutes. OK. OK, we're going to finish this cake off, mate. We've got some beautiful walnut meal. Whoa. We're going to fold that through the mascarpone. That's going to act as our icing. And we'll split this vanilla pod. Lovely. So this is basically going to be the icing for the cake. I love the little orange zest you got planned. Let's get that into our, uh, our piping bag. Bingo. Yep. Bingo. Mate, brandy snaps, old brandy school. Brandy snaps, I love them. 1985, here we come. Good bit of texture on there, though. Lovely. Oozing out the end. Oh, that is good. Mate, you don't get a glass until you finish plating Let's up. Let's go. All these walnut elements, we've got the walnut sponge, we've got the candied walnuts, and then we're going to finish it with some carrot marmalade, oh. some carrot sorbet. Wow, look at that. If that doesn't deserve a glass of Chardonnay, I don't know what does. Scotty, Mate. is it going to look that good at your place on Christmas Day? Wow. If you bring some of your uh, fantastic walnuts, then definitely. All right, let's get into it. Oh, look at that. Bingo. Mm. Oh, all right.